Alrighty guys, so welcome back to another Ultimate Driving video. My name is of course Carboom and today we're going to be checking out the brand new Ultimate Driving update which is really, really cool. It's definitely got some awesome new additions. It's got a really cool looking car in this update and probably the most important thing in this update, a brand new daily reward system. That's something that Ultimate Driving has been missing out for a long, long time. Other games like Vehicle Simulator have had it for a while now. But now Ultimate Driving have got it in here. We're going to talk about that. And it even has a limited car that you can get for free after only five days of playing. So guys, let's get right into this video. <laughs> Alright guys, so like I said in the intro, this is the brand new daily bonus rewards that you get for just logging into the game. So there's five days in total for this first one. I'm guessing they'll change after five days. Maybe they'll add new rewards. I don't know. I cannot wait to see where they take this. But for the first day, you get 3,000 credits. That's 3,000 coins for just logging in. And day two, you get 5,000. Day three, you get a carbon fiber skin, which looks really clean and nice. It looks pretty much black with a tiny little bit of um, detail in there with a little bit of uh, texture, which I really, really like. It looks nice and clean, not too, like, jumping out at you. Just a nice look to your car. Day four, you get 7,000 credits. And then day five is where you get the special car. So after five days, if you log in every single day for five days, you'll get this car. So not too much has been released about this special car yet. I'm guessing it'll be limited edition. I'm not sure if they'll put it into the dealership once the people have got it after the five days. Um, I'm not sure if this will just be a limited edition thing. Of course, you'll get it for free with this day of the rewards thing. But I'm not sure if it'll be a limited car. That would be very, very cool if it was a limited car. If, and if they did this every week or so, a new limited car in the game, that would be really, really awesome. But all I can really say about this is the real life car that it's based on, which is the Mitsubishi FTO GPX. So, and nothing else has really been announced. The max speed hasn't been announced, the 0 60 has not been announced, the price is obviously free in this, but nothing else has been announced yet. So there's not too much I can comment on this, sadly. Uh, we'll have to check back in five days. I'll do another video checking this car out after I get it in five days. I'll keep coming on every single day, and I recommend you come on every single day as well to get this car. Even if it isn't a limited edition car, it still might be. So definitely come out and try and get this. It's only You only have to log in, collect, then leave if you want for five continuous days. So you might as well try and get it. But now we're gonna check out the other brand new car in this update, which is a car that you can buy in the dealership right now. So let's go check that out. All right guys, so this is the second new car in this update. Obviously the first one isn't actually technically out yet, but this is the only car that you can buy and drive right now in this update and it is probably just by taking a quick glance of it is probably the most detailed car in ultimate driving for some reason it isn't letting me zoom in um i can't remember if that was a feature or not i think we could zoom in before but just by looking around at it there is some crazy crazy detail you can see the interior just by looking out here it has everything it has a steering wheel it has the speedometers it even has aircon in there I can't wait to check this out. It just looks absolutely crazy. And of course, it has the brand new chassis system on it, which I'll probably be doing a comparison video with the new and old chassis in the coming days. So make sure you subscribe to that if you want to know the differences between the new and the old chassis. So this car has a top speed of 177 miles per hour, 0 to 16, 3.8 seconds, and a cash back of 756 cash per mile. And will cost you a very odd number of 236,590 cash. That is a very, very odd number to pay for a car. Uh, but there we go. We're going to drive. We're going to buy it. I cannot wait to check this car out even more. So let's take a deeper look into it. All right, you guys. So now we've got it spawned out and it is looking super super cool the brake lights look super super cool there's a cool meshing on the indicator right there that is awesome some nice carbon fiber on the wing and the back as well it looks really really awesome you can see under the bottom so i'm not sure if that's meant to be as <laughs> you can see right into the seats um i wouldn't imagine it would be like that but there we go and now i'm just gonna hop out and we can look in the interior 
it looks absolutely crazy. Why is the car moving? I parked it. Alrighty, guys. So there we go. The interior is looking absolutely fantastic. I think it is definitely the most detailed car in this game with the interior and the outside. For some reason, the parking brake, I don't think, is working. Um, it's moving, I think, even when I put the parking brake on. But there we go. That is the best look we have. Sadly, there's no pedals yet. I don't think we've seen pedals in a car in ultimate driving yet. But we've got everything else. We've got aircon. We've got the speedometer. We've got the steering wheel. We've got the seats. We have so much in here. That is really, really awesome. All ultimate driving needs now is a first person view. Now, with more and more cars having interiors like this, we need a first person view. And maybe if the steering wheel moved as well, that would be very, very cool. But one step at a time. Hopefully, one of these days, we will get a first-person view. That would be absolutely, absolutely awesome. So, this car, I think, is one of my favorite cars right now. Not by speed or anything, just by how it looks. Oh, my gosh, I'm so sorry. Oh, no, I'm so sorry. I was driving on the wrong side of the road. But just by how it looks, it looks absolutely amazing. Every little part, I've been being pushed around I can't get over how cool this car actually looks, and ah, uh, it's now in the water. So now that it's day, we can take a much better look at this car. The spoiler that I missed has some really nice details in there. That looks really, really nice. I really like the spoiler. It's very, very big. It seems very sporty. I really like it. The front of the car just looks absolutely crazy. We have some cool little mesh in there that isn't actually a texture, which... Most cars probably would just add a texture there, but that is actually modeled. That is something that you can really appreciate. And guys, this is a really, really cheap car. To say what it actually does, it has a new chassis, it drives pretty fast, and it just looks absolutely amazing. I really, really hope from now on all cars will look like this, because if they do, we are looking at a very, very good future for ultimate driving. So if you are looking for a car that is fairly good, you want to drive with the new chassis and it looks absolutely stunning uh the detail just looks crazy and it looks fast as well i really like the look of this car then definitely check this car out guys it is an awesome awesome car to pick up now there is a this is a modification of the base model that is already in the game that is a viper as well and sadly looking into it just a little bit off camera it turns out the specs of the mod this modification one the brand new one isn't as good as the old Viper, which is a little bit odd because this definitely looks a lot faster than the old Viper, but I don't think that matters too, too much because, like I said, it may not be as fast as the other Viper in the game, but it definitely looks better. And of course, it has a brand new chassis system built into it, which is always a good thing, especially at a cheap price like this. But guys, I'm going to end this video off here. I hope you did enjoy. Definitely, definitely come on every day for five days in a row. Even if it is just to collect it and then go off, you might as well to get this possibly limited edition car. I'm not too, too sure if it's going to be limited edition or not, but definitely you might as well get a free car out of this and a carbon fiber skin and coins as well. Don't forget, you will get quite a bit of coins for just coming on. So it's definitely a reason to come on. Check on the driving out every day to, to get the car carbon fiber skin and some extra coins but guys i hope you did enjoy thank you so much for watching this video definitely definitely subscribe if you haven't already uh, because it'll help the channel grow and you won't want to miss the video where i compare the new chassis and the old chassis and in five days time the brand new car that is in the daily reward system so guys i hope you did enjoy like the video if you did because it'll help the video get out there and notify people to definitely come out and check ultimate driving out every day for five days in a row if they want to get this free car so guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye guys